Project Natick is a radical approach to how we deploy data centers. Basically what we're doing is we're taking green data centers deploying in the ocean, off the coast. The overall goal here is deploy data centers at scale anywhere in the world from decision to power on uh, within 90 days. Half the world's population lives within 200 kilometers of the sea. So moving data centers to the ocean made a great amount of sense to be able to make the actual cable to our customers as short as possible. The servers are standard type servers you would find at any data center that have been modified for this particular environment since it's in a marine situation. And then the server has the coolant system attached to the outside. There's all the control electronics that live on the outside of the rack. And then as you move further out, you get to the steel shell. From the steel shell outside, we have all the heat exchangers that are attached to that shell, as well as the outputs for all of our cabling to go back up to the surface. It's kind of like launching a satellite to space. Once you've built it and you hand it to the guys with the rocket, or in this case, our case, a crane, you can't do anything about it if it screws up. Pump is off. And pump's off. Okay, pump's off. Flip switch. Send the divers in. Humidity's yeah. dropping. That's good. Okay, and is everything stable now? Everything is stable and on. What's our power consumption? 27 kilowatts. All right. And NATO could have a lot of impact both currently and into the future. It's not like a moonshot in the sense that it's just some outlandish thing. It's actually a viable product that we could make. <laughs>